Hi, welcome to Doing Info. Today I'm going to show you how we can transfer files from an iPhone to your Windows PC. I know it's easy transfer file from an Android phone to a Windows PC or an iPhone to a MacBook or other way around but it's really hard to transfer files from an iPhone to a Windows PC or from a Windows PC to an iPhone. The method I'm going to use is not OneDrive or not Dropbox or iCloud files. It's a e simple and easy process. You don't need to install any additional application. It's a little bit complicated for first time and once you have created all the sets and permissions then next time it's gonna be very easy for you to use so I would request please follow all the steps so the first step is your computer needs to be connected with the hotspot of your phone on your phone screen tap on the setting app here and then you can see at the bottom it says personal hotspot you can click over there and then you can swipe to the allow other devices to connect keep in mind the password mentioned underneath so then you need to type this password on to the laptop side so from the computer side you need to go and click on your Wi-Fi icon and from the available networks find your phone name click on that and then hit connect if you connect the first time it might ask you the password okay now since we have established a connection between our computer and our phone both are connected through a hotspot we need to take a note of the IP address of this computer for that you need to click on Windows icon type CMD in the command prompt you need to type a command IP config okay so scroll down you can see here at the bottom you need to note down this uh, IP address normally when you connect to the hotspot the IP address stays the same but keep a note of this IP address because we need this IP address later second process you need to open the command prompt and now we need to create one new user so for new user you need to type this command you also can copy the command from description type new user colon here the username I am going to put the username as a transfer but you can put anything else put the colon again and then put the password for the colon again password i'm gonna put the one two three you can use any other one two three and the colon space forward slash and type add press enter so once you have created that local user account then we need to create a new folder on the desktop you can create in in the documents wherever you want so just right click on the desktop go to new and press the folder and put the name folder name as transfer now we need to set the permission of this folder so just right click go to the properties click on the sharing tab and click share here you need to add and give the permission to the transfer account which we have created earlier so click on the transfer press add and the permission you need to give read and write once you have done this click share you, your folder is shared and done after that you need to click on advanced sharing 
click on the share this folder then click on permissions then press add here you need to type your account which is transfer click on check name here is the transfer click ok and give it a full control press apply ok and then apply and ok and close now we have created a share folder on our desktop from the phone side you need to click on your files app and then click upper right corner on the three dots then click on connect to the server and from the server name you need to type the IP address of the computer so remember I told you earlier keep in mind keep a note of this IP address so here you need to type 172.20.10.7 that was the IP address of my laptop and then hit connect on the upper right corner and from here you need to make sure is on the second option not the guest and then the name username was transfer uh, which the user we created on the computer and the password was 123 so type transfer 123 hit connect and boom we are right into our transfer folder it's exactly the same as the computer so click on transfer folder and now uh, we will share some files from here to computer you need to go to your photos app for example there is a picture you want to share you need to select this one this one and one video and then click on the share icon at the bottom right corner then scroll down to the bottom save two files click here and it will automatically land in your transfer folder plus save here and you can see as soon you press the save uh, the file appeared on your uh, computer so it's that easy to transfer the file even it was one video one one movie now I will show you how to transfer videos and the files from your computer to the iPhone I have some files here let's scroll down let's copy all of these pictures copy and then paste into this transfer folder like open this transfer folder and click right paste boom so you can see as soon you paste these files it start appearing on your phone it's that easy just keep this in mind these files are still not saved onto your phone memory you are viewing them from the computer share folder so in order to save them on your phone open any picture and then bottom left corner click on the share icon and then scroll at the bottom and you will see save click on that save and that way you will save this picture onto your uh, photos app so in order to check just go to photos and see at the bottom the file has been saved over there i hope you like my video i know it's a little bit lengthy and i hope the apple can make it a little bit not too much but a little bit easier for us to understand but if it's not working for you please comment down below and uh, we will get at the bottom of this i will catch you up into the next video until then bye bye